Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today we're trying one of these new Lean Cuisine Marketplace meals. This one is the Panko Crusted Chicken Romano. It is Panko Crusted White Meat Chicken with Cavatappi Pasta. That's just the shape of the pasta. Um, in a smoky tomato sauce with Romano cheese. It sounds really good. Um, looks good too. It is a nine and three quarter ounce or 276 gram meal. We bought these at Meijer. It was only $2, so that's pretty cheap for a Lean Cuisine meal actually. 360 calories for the entire package. There's your other info. Yeah, everything's pretty decent on there. So directions, there are no directions for the oven, so I guess you can only do microwave. So leave film on the product, cook on high for three and a half minutes, stir and recover, and then cook for another minute and a half. So three and a half stir, recover in one and a half and let it stand one minute to finish off. So, ah, yeah, looks pretty decent. You get, what, one, two, three, four, five pieces of chicken. So if you cut those up, you basically get 10 bites of chicken. Yeah, they look like old chicken nuggets. So I'm gonna get this in the microwave and I'll be back. All right, so here it is out of the microwave and um, you see it's got quite a bit of sauce in there. The chicken and the pasta, some tomatoes. The, um, I've noticed the panko, the breadcrumbs are kind of soft, so they're definitely not crispy, but since there's no oven directions, you know, that's how they're going to be. Um, yeah, they're just kind of, kind of mushy on the outside. So I'm going to uh, let this cool off, probably cut these chicken nuggets in half, and I'll be back. Okay, so here's the bite I'm going to take. It's got chicken and pasta and some of the tomatoes on there, so, or peppers. I think they're tomatoes. Anyway. By the way, it had a really strong uh, smoky smell when it was in the microwave. You get a little bit of that flavor of the smokiness, but it's not as strong as the smell was. Let me try just some of the pasta. Good texture on the pasta. It's um, it's not overcooked, so it's not really mushy. It's not undercooked, so it's not hard. It's just right in the middle. The chicken itself. It's good. You can tell um, it's cooked well. I think it's it may be processed. It looks like it is um, like reformed chicken. It's like uh, I don't think it's like like hunked up sliced chicken. I think it's ground up and, and reprocessed. I could be wrong though because it doesn't have the texture of process, but it kind of looks like the the way it is. It, it looks like it is, but it's probably not. It may be actually chopped up. The texture is good. It's not, it doesn't have that graininess of processed chicken, so maybe you just um, chopped up pieces. Um, the panko crumbs, though, they almost might as well not have been there. You get a little bit of the flavor of them, but texture-wise, they're just mushy. They, they're like this mushy bread, so um, they're, they really don't add any texture to it beyond mushiness. Um, flavor-wise, they're pretty decent. The whole thing is it's okay. You get the, a little bit of the smokiness from the sauce, but that's about it. I don't even really taste the cheese, which that's one of the big um, things that's even in the title, Panko Crusted Chicken Romano. Um, I really don't get the cheese flavor either. And that first bite I took had a lot of the cheese in it, which I don't really see a lot of cheese cheese in here anyway. Um, it's not like it's a super like macaroni and cheese cheese meal. I get mostly the smokiness from the sauce and then you get the um, just the chicken, the panko and the chicken flavor. It's definitely not a bad meal, but it's not a great meal. It's not, it, it needs more flavor in there. It needs more sauce in there. It needs more cheese. It needs more something. Um, I'm going to give it a three out of five. It's just your average everyday meal. It's nothing exciting. Um, it's nothing bad. It's just not exciting either. It just needs something else in addition to what it is. So I'm going to give it a three out of five. Definitely worth trying out if you like this kind of meal and you're trying to uh, be lean cuisine to save on your calories and stuff. That that's, works great. Um, if you're looking for something a little bit more flavorful, you're not going to get it in this meal. So, hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.